the event that the aerial apparatus must be short jacked. The apparatus operator should fully extend the stabilizer on the side the aerial device will be going over. The extension arms on the opposite side should be extended as far as possible. The operator must remember the load and range capabilities are reduced when the outriggers are short jacked. The operator should lift the rear tires one and a half inches off the ground and level the turntable. All stabilizer lights should be green and the stabilizer pins set. The diverter valve can now be switched to aerial mode. To unbed the short jacked aerial ladder, the operator needs the assistance of another to hold down the stabilizer override switch on the stabilizer control panel. This switch only needs to be pushed long enough for the ladder to clear the sensor. Another option, in place of the stabilizer override button, is an aerial override knob located on the rear of the apparatus. In the event that the apparatus operator must rotate the aerial ladder to the short jack side, the rotation limit switch must be held to bypass the aerial limit sensor on the short jack side. The operator also has the ability to override the aerial limit sensor by using the rotational override lever underneath the first step of the aerial ladder. Rotational limit override must be utilized when the ladder is rotated back in line with the truck. The stabilizer override switch must be used to finally bed the ladder. 